is up everybody it has been a minute since we've done a video and i hope that we get enough stuff on this video uh or this outing to make even make a video but it is raining like crazy today off and on all day we've already had like probably three quarters of an inch of rain and we got a big storm just south of us headed right this way and the river's coming up a little bit so we got some worms and we come down here to the river usually pretty good you know when the river's coming up uh dropping some worms right here, right through this grass area and turn you around here okay. it's moving a little bit fast up out you know just out a little ways but we're not throwing very far off the bank and years ago we used to we used to come down here whenever the river was coming up and we'd fish with worms along this grass and we'd catch some pretty good channel cat so me and the boys are out here gonna give it a go we got three rods out one each all of them's got worms on them and hopefully uh yeah look at that man that stuff is just it's thundering like crazy it's it's gonna be good hopefully if it does come in and rain um being under this bridge we'll be able to stay out of it and hopefully get some catch some fish uh, we get anything we'll bring you back Seems like they're down there ways, huh? It feels pretty good right now. That was a guard, Colton. Did you see it? See what? That guard right there. Where is that? Hmm? He just broke the water right there. Well, he better just step out of the water. Someone burned a lot of stuff out here. Who's that? Burned a drug paraphernalia. Paraphernalia. Dad, are there crabs in the sand or what? How about hookworms? What are those? They hook into your skin and make it itch real bad. That's actually weird because my foot actually just started itching. That, that's not even... You live in the sand? They crawl around in your skin until they hatch and they, they leave. No, but they're sand, sand fleas. I yeah, see them. Sand fleas. Can we go get it? No. I was thinking if we 
Thousand, you know. But shit, I'm going to the store. So I went up to the store and I'm playing these two dollar ones. Nice bad no. I hit a little bit on this one, a little bit on this one. I played the red ruby one. Mm -hmm. That son of a bitch wouldn't stop hitting. It just kept on. It got me over two thousand dollars. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh yeah. Hey, it's right up on We should have brought it. We should have brought the ice cream. These are not good. Excuse me, ice cream. Don't get the ice cream. I was like, I hope these son of a bitch is taking it. That was like. Oh, it must be a little loaded over there. If you could find a hole somewhere. It's like a dip in the sand all around right there. I'm gonna fix this camera down. There you go. But like, Dad was like, called Dad was like, we can believe we shell out the $700 ticket in my freaking pocket. He goes, you better go get it. Uh, we'll take it. So I was like, I ain't walking up to him. I'm just gonna stick it in the machine. Yeah. And Oh, wow. That's what I'll do. What the fuck are you doing? Clean past you. So, first machine I went in there. I don't care. I'm going to stick it in. I stuck it in. Please take it. Please take it. Because you only got one day. Oh, yeah. So, cash it in. First. Oh, up there we got him hurt too. Yeah, it was good. Bob Mike. It is toasty. It's really not that hot. It's really humid though. But we had three boxes of worms, but they've been in our fridge for about a week or a little over. Well, actually, they haven't. They've only been in there for about five days. Um, but I don't know how long they were in the fridge or the place that we bought them at. Anyway, out of those three boxes of worms, there was only like maybe five worms that were good. The rest of them were kind of a ball of mush. We kind of dug through them and got little pieces out here and there. But we did catch a few fish. I hope you guys... Uh, enjoyed what little bit little bit we showed you uh, wasn't a whole lot caught there's a whole lot down there man we i missed several myself but they're all small uh it was something to do though it was nice to get out and do a little fishing it's been a while um anyway uh hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, they'll be coming a little more frequent now hopefully uh the weather's you know it's it's mid-july and it's it's hot but it's, it, this week is not supposed to be all that hot so we're gonna get out we're gonna do some fishing we're just talking about vince has got all this rain 
we got a a low water bridge that we used to fish at. We haven't been there in a long time. Uh, that when it comes up, it kind of makes a dam. You know, the fish can't go no further, and then flatheads get up in there sometimes. And you can really catch a few. We're thinking about if the creek is up tomorrow, we might run out there tomorrow evening. If maybe we can't catch a catch a few, swing by Elmer's and go for some perch, and then uh, head over to that crossing. It's, it's just down the road from Elmer's, and see if see if we can get lucky and catch a catch a couple of big fish uh anyway that's kind of the plan for right this minute um like i say if you guys enjoyed the video hit that subscribe button give me that thumbs up god bless we'll see you